Yo, 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 YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy Mike835 again, coming at you with another G Shock review, G Shock unboxing. What is up, YouTube? What is up? Let me show you what I got here. I found this in my storage a while ago, and I figured I never showed this custom watch, custom G Shock DW6900. And without further ado, I would like to share with you guys today put this lovely pillow to the side so you see this is a custom 6900 this watch was done by a buddy of mine his name is uh, DJ Fitzgerald he was uh, collecting G-Shocks for a very very long time I'm not sure if he's still collecting G-Shocks but the process that he used to make this uh, lovely lovely koi band fish design band was with a process that he carved it out with a machine and then he colored it in which is really cool in my opinion and if you see here, these letters right here, what they mean is 835, as you know, Mike 835. He custom designed this watch for me, and that says 835 in Japanese. I love anything that has to do with fishes, koi, aquariums. I'm a big uh, liker of all fish things. I like to fish. I like to keep uh, fish. I like African cichlids, saltwater fish. I don't have. I would like to have, you know, in the future, a nice tank. So um, let me show you here what I have. He also engraved the screen. Now, I'm not sure how you guys would feel about this. I decided to let him do this on this watch for me that I sent him because I felt that this piece, even though that the screen is engra engraved, as you see here, it's still, I mean, I still can see the time. And its it was more of an art piece to me than something like, you know, it wasn't, it, this watch was never assigned, um, you know, assigned to be a practical watch, a watch for everyday wear. But in my opinion, it is a very, very beautiful watch and a great design he did. Let me zoom out here so you guys can see the whole watch. In the whole entirety very nice you guys are wondering what model he used it's the DW 6900 PL I believe that stands for Polaroid polarized Polaroid or polarized one of those two I'm not sure how many customs he ever did DJ but um this is a piece that it's it's a lovely piece. It's very unique. It's it's definitely one of a kind. So I would, you know, enjoy today bringing you this G-Shock review on this uh, custom DW sixty nine hundred. He also, as you see here, he added um, a goldish buckle to the piece. Very nice. The functions work. Everything's working how it should. Just the screen is etched. Stopwatch. Countdown timer. It's all perfect. How about the light? Is it still working? Stopwatch. Stopwatch is working just perfect. It's one of those faces that are a little hard to get on the camera. That's what they call it, the Polaroid. Finish. How about the light? Let's see. Is it working or not? Let me take off my cam, my light here. Is it working? Let's see. Yeah, light's still good. Perfect. We have light again, guys. It's been your boy, Mike835, bringing you a very, very close up on this uh, custom G-Shock from DJ Fitzgerald, Koi Fish, Mike835 watch. Definitely one of a kind. Guys, if you did enjoy my video today, please hit that subscribe button and click that notification bell. I'm very excited to uh, get back into the G-Shock collecting and the, you know, doing these reviews for you guys. Uh, would be great if you guys uh, support my channels. 
And um, I'll see you on the next one. Thank you for watching today. It's been your boy Mike835. Bring a little custom G-Shock DW6900. Review and unboxing.